stocks opened lower after the Greek prime minister admitted that some creditors rejected their proposals for a debt deal. In other news, Lennar's profit rose 33 percent as it sold more homes at higher prices. Ford Motors stock price target has been raised to $19 from 18 at Goldman Sachs. And Monsanto beat earnings estimates but missed on sales. The buyback plan is on hold while it tries to buy Syngenta. Well, the economic slowdown early this year was less severe than previously estimated, putting the U.S. on a trajectory for stronger growth later in 2015. Gross domestic product, the broadest sum of goods and services produced across the economy, contracted at a two-tenths of a percent rate, according to the Commerce Department. The agency previously estimated output fell seven-tenths from January through March. Consumer spending was stronger than expected. Well, IKEA raising the minimum wage for its workers for a second year in a row. Starting January 1st, IKEA's average minimum hourly wage will increase to $11.87. That is $4.62 above the current federal wage and is a $1.11 increase or 10% from this year's average minimum pay at IKEA. The furniture chain is looking to improve its relations with workers and reduce turnover. That is a wrap for us, but be sure to track breaking news and analysis all day at thestreet.com. At the NASDAQ market site in Times Square, I'm Jane King for The Street. Have a great day.